in the breaking news coming in from Juventus is that Juventus have been given a partial stadium ban for its next home game in the Italian Cup after some of its supporters directed racist chants at Inter Milan striker Romel Lukaku. It's official. Fulham striker Alexander Mitrovic has been banned by FA for eight matches after the incident with the referee Chris Kavanagh at Old Trafford. It happens here. It's a done deal and it's confirmed. Chelsea have confirmed that Frank Lampard will take charge as caretaker manager until the end of the season. Talks still going on with Julian Nagelsmann and the club. It happens here. In the transfer news coming in is that Saudi Arabian club Al Hilal have made an official bid to sign Lionel Messi. The salary is believed to be more than 400 million euros per year, but Messi has rejected a contract offer. He wishes to stay in Europe at least until Copa America 2024. His career at PSG expires at the end of the season. It happens here. In the sports news coming in from Arsenal Football Club is that negotiations are currently underway between Arsenal and Rhys Nelson representatives for a contract extension. His current deal expires in June this year and Ateta would be happy to keep Rhys while more European clubs are showing interest in potential free transfer for the player. Jack Harrison has signed a new five-year deal with Leeds United, it happens here. Leeds director of football, Victor Otter, said, Jack is a crucial part of our squad and our plans going forward, and I'm really happy he has agreed to commit his long-term future to the club. In the news coming in from PSG is that Galatia will no longer be PSG head coach next season, it happens here. The French club are planning to contact Julian Nagelsmann and Zidane is also among the potential managers to take over the job at the club. Man City, Man United and Real Madrid are all interested in signing Benjamin Pavard. He has just over 12 months left on his contract deal and is considering his options. In the news coming in from PSC is that PSC have started talks to extend El Chadile Bichiabu's contract. He was born 2005. Talks are currently ongoing at the club. It happens here. In the transfer news coming in from Leicester City is that City are leading the race to sign Georgi as the Georgian goalkeeper is attracting a lot of interest. His agent, Levan, is in London working on a summer move for his player. A move for Randall Kolo Mwani, which was recently ruled out by the bosses, could become an option for Bayern Munich again following the arrival of Tuchel. This is it. Tuchel wants to have a complete picture of which players fit his philosophy. In the transfer news coming in is that Man United, Barcelona and Bayern are all interested in the player and had direct meetings with Jeremy Frippong's agent Jeffrey Lamet. Bayern's priority is to decide on Cancelo in May. Baka's situation unclear due to financial fair play. It happens here. It happens here. It's official. Switzerland will host Women's Euro of 2025. The race to sign Matteo Retegui remains open. Entrach Fakfat want him but nothing has been agreed yet, not even on personal terms. Inter Milan have already had approaches to understand deal conditions but nothing concrete with Atletico Madrid at this stage. The Ukrainian talent Georgi Sudakov has signed a new contract at Shakhtar Donetsk. It happens here. The contract is valid for the next five years. It's done and confirmed. Born in 2002 and considered one of the top genes of Ukrainian football. It happens here. Barcelona have reached an agreement with JP Morgan and Goldman Sachs over the financing of Espia Baka. The works for the new Spotify company will commence in September. Still in the transfer news, Heather Berlin are closing in on agreement to sign professional long-term deal with Julius Gottschalk. Talented attacking midfielder, aged 16 years, had four proposals but he's close to accept the new deal offered by Heather Berlin. It happens here.